Welcome, welcome back, my dearest friends. I'm Yana, and this is your Vintage Beauties, and I am back. I thought I will not make it today. I am recording this video very late on Monday. Usually, this is already recorded in the morning or day before. But my son is moving out. We've been moving stuff, and it's been exciting for him. And today I had interviews back to back to back. So I couldn't. I was contemplating. I was like, no, I can't leave my friends without a video. I just can't do it. And this bag is calling my name. So thank you so much for your guys' feedback regarding last video. You know what? This is not me, to be honest with you. We're going to go back to piles and tangles and just chatting together, okay? And I'm going to try to do the best I can with the focus. And you guys were right. My videos were foggy, uh, foggy and you were telling me, and maybe your lens. And I looked, and my lens was so dirty on my phone. And I was like, how I didn't think of it? I am a technical person. How I didn't think of it? I totally forgot. So I hopefully... Oh, this is cool. <gasps> this is awesome. Yeah, so how I didn't like think of it to begin with. Now it's crispy. All right, let's get going. We're finishing the bag we started last time. If you like anything and like to purchase it and you want to know the price, just simply mail me at yourvintagebeauties at gmail.com. And give me the timestamp of the item and a brief description, and I'll give you the price, and we'll go from there. All right? You know the gist. You know the drill. And again, don't forget to subscribe. I'm slowly but surely getting close to 5,000. I really want to get to 5,000. I don't know why. I just, it's my kind of dream to get to 5,000. And once we get there, we're uh, going to have big giveaway. Okay? All right. I also kind of been thinking about membership something small you know like tiny and maybe privately just uh, you know membership people we're gonna get together and live you know once a month live do a jewelry unboxing and just chat like real life you know if you want to hang out with me in the real life kind of unbagging let me know okay all right let's get going this one jumps right out i'm not sure if there's a um, chain in there but here is a pendant we have nine to five and something else let's see nine to five afic oh oh i forgot to turn on my pressy because we want to know if this is an onyx okay so while pressy is I doubt this diamonds around. I don't think so. I think it's just uh, CZs. But while a pressy is warming up, we're going to set it aside. Okay, right here we have a stretchy bracelet. A very nice stretch. It's gold tone and silver tone kind of links. Very, very nice stretch. Uh, where is my cone? S size 7. I don't think there are any names or anything nice bracelet oh this is cute look at this bracelet does it no i thought it was missing a uh, very pretty rhinestone silver tone and rhinestones fold over clasp size seven also let's see nice opens nice very cute. Some rhinestones are a little bit darker than the others. Very pretty bracelet. Look at this. Cute. Size 7. All right, let's take a look. Yeah, this is definitely like an onyx situation. I don't think I'll be able to touch the little rhinestones. If it beeps, guys, if it uh, it's it means I touched the uh, I touched the um, metal. Let me try. I'm so scared. CZs. Yeah, these are CZs. Oh, see, I touched it. Yeah, these are CZs. 
All right, let's see if we have a chain somewhere. Somewhere in there. Okay, oh, this is so cute. Glass pepper. So we have Silver Town bracelet. Yeah, Silver Town bracelet and couple charms. One is a um, glass pepper. I think his tip is um, chipped. I think his tip, yeah, and this bead. To be honest, I'm gonna put it to craft. Yeah, because it's chipped. Uh, right here we have hematite necklace. I don't know what this is though. Is it an animal or what is this? I I don't know what this is. Well, someone really gave me a really awesome idea to tape right here, and it's gonna be way easier. And I think. I think they're right. I think I, I'm gonna do that, you know. Let's see, I'm gonna leave it like this for now. Not taped. Okay, so the drop is nine inches drop on this hematite necklace. Um, I don't know, give me ideas. What do you think this is or who? Right here I have a pendant, AB coated rhinestone, really poorly glued inside. Let me know if you're interested in them. Ooh, another bracelet fold over a clasp. I don't see no stamps. And we have a black rhinestones right here. They're glass. And the size is seven. All right. Actually, I think sometimes I looked at it and sometimes my focus concentrates on it. So size seven bracelet, very clean, very nice. Now we have, oh, this one's pretty silver tone bracelet there's nothing here on the tag we have rhinestone and then we have just rhinestones like, like this interesting there is no extender you can't really move it i think it's just like this how do i close it okay here we go very clean very pretty rhinestones let me measure it it's seven very pretty uh, memory wire bracelet with shells another memory wire bracelet uh oh hold on what happened here okay here we go there are like bells at the end, one end, and the other end is dolphin, is on the other end. Silver tone <clears throat> with some beads and shells. Oh, there's a bell right here. Okay. Um, this one is, I think, like, um, I honestly don't know what this is. There is like a hole, something was here. I don't know what this is. Maybe a ring, maybe not. There is a hole right here. Uh, just in case if you want to know the size the size is five and a quarter but it's in a craft and it is magnetic oh <clears throat> oh. oh this is nice all right let me measure the size of this really quickly size seven we have a gold tone bracelet fold over clasp and there are no stones right here. It's just little, really tiny, like, nodules. And there is no name on um, on the bracelet. A fold over clasp is nice. Oh, there is something. I found it. I found it right here. We have a stamp. Oh, I think this one is a Liz Claiborne. I'll see. Liz Claiborne bracelet. All right, size seven. 
so i'm not sure how long this video is gonna be but hopefully we're gonna finish this bag yeah hopefully we're gonna finish this bag all right nice another silver tone bracelet on a tag it says oh interesting it says Dear Dama, 925 Italy, right on. So we have a silver bracelet right here. Very pretty links. They are, they're not hammered. They kind of have the Egyptian style kind of a design. Very pretty. Size is seven and a quarter. There are no other extenders. Dear Dama, 925, that's nice, awesome lucky us oh earrings okay oh this pretty pulse very bling blingy earrings gold tone pulse with rhinestones pretty oh what is this oh, this is interesting how, how does it work okay so we have a tag it says on a tag it says oh, I was gonna say Lazarus but let's see what's what does it say Liz Paisius SF Liz Paisius SF and nothing else never heard of this designer but it reminds me a little bit of maybe like um, Ayala Bar. I think these ones are a real turquoise maybe. It is very, very, very dainty. Um, you know, very interesting. That Oh, this art. Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see. So, uh oh. Oh, wow. Where's my handy dandy detangler? Da -da 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 -da. Here we go. Here we go. So this is very interesting necklace. So we have three strands, right? And this they are like this. So we have three strands of brassy color chains. Yeah, we have an extender and it is a lobster claw. So then they're connected to this flower. And then we have very dramatic, very dramatic layering, guys. Very dramatic. Let me show you. Oh. Come on. See? Very dramatic. One, two, and like... I'm, I think it would be better if I'll show you on, on the neck. So it's like this. So hard to show. Here we go. Do you see it? It's like this. Very short, medium, and then very, very long. We have rhinestones. We have very pretty rhinestones. All the rhinestones are here. Red and green flowers. And then we have natural turquoise, I believe. They do look like turquoise very nice very pretty i've never heard of this designer i'm gonna have to google and research but the necklace is gorgeous and actually speaking of i'm just gonna put it immediately in the in the bag because it's very very dainty kind of yeah i don't want to break it awesome so it's the least paacious something like that very cool moving right along we're finding this crosses in every single bag silver tone chain with a cross 
next I have gold tone necklace magnetic it does have long extender and a lobster claw and right here we have kind of like a pendants or decorations I don't know which way it goes probably this way because it's oh I have a little bit of it paint I was paint, repainting my son's room kind of touching it up see like this very pretty what is this I can't I'm, I, I'm trying to tag it out oh it's because it has a um, it has a shepherd's hook closure so this is probably this is probably a um, choker it has an extender it has a hook i do not see any names and it's not magnetic but i don't see any stamps let's see i don't think it's silver I don't think so very very hard to scratch no this is not silver it is silver tone kind of a choker it has really pretty flowers right here at the ends and the size is the shortest one is 12 and a half inches the shortest one that's pretty short okay and the longest one is 15 inches either way it's 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 a choker okay stud earrings oh again focus 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 stud earrings diamond shape Oh. right here we have very cool bracelet the it has faux pearls it might be gold filled let's take a look uh -huh. what does it say gold field yeah looks like it's gold field uh, faux pearls it does have a chain security chain the bracelet uh, size six and a half gold tone and kind of a caged pearls faux pearls okay let's take a look at this necklace so we have a bib style necklace oh, this is kind of weird you know touching this kind of makes sticky like this i need to wash this ones i don't know why they're sticky so we have a gold tone chain we have an extender a lobster claw it's there are no scratches or anything so it seems to be new it has a lace right here but these ones are kind of sticky yeah i need to wash this mint color rhinestones yeah i just need to wash it here is the back no name okay pretty what is this All right, another another bracelet, gold tone with rhinestones. Some rhinestones have clear rhinestones around, some are just bold. And right here we have a tag. We have a little rhinestone over here and a letter M over here. We have a lobster claw. We have a closure. The biggest one the big oh this is so pretty definitely glass such a pretty color seven the biggest one is seven to the very end 
Okay, so it's uh, the biggest one. Okay, so this is pretty necklace. So we have a shepherd's hook. I think it's Trifari. Yeah, right here we have Trifari. Very clean, very, very clean necklace. Faux pearls are in a great condition. We have a long extender. They are not in between. They are not real. They are faux pearls. They are glass, I would assume. Yeah, they're glass pearls. They do have some weight to it. The very, very short length is 13 inches. The very short. And the longest one is... 16. The shortest is 13, the longest is 16, and they're kind of metallic on the greenish side. Kind of on the greenish side, metallic. Well, maybe it just looks like it to me. I don't know. But they're very clean and have some nice weight. So, right here, I see a peridot, I think, or a venturine. Yep, peridot. Chips. Let me try to detangle it out of it, out of this mess. Okay, very nice strand of peridot chips. This drop is 17. Drop is 17. There are no closure. It's just a strand. Very pretty peridot chips. Very pretty. Okay, right here we have a bracelet, and you know what, now looking at it, it seems to me like a recently so sold necklace like this, but I'm not sure. Okay, there is no extender, let me give you the size, size is six and a quarter, we have two strands, they're very pretty faceted green and pink beads, and we have a hook, a bronzy hook, and right here, there is a right here. There is a M G, I think. Okay, I think it's very, very pretty. Very pretty uh, glass beads, glass necklace, uh, bracelet. Very pretty. Okay. Uh, right here we have another bracelet. I think we have like um, some type of uh, shell beads. We have a barrel clasp. Gold tone barrel clasp. No extender. And we have uh, shell beads. The size is 7. Okay. Size 7. This might be Indian necklace or something. Um, not really sure what this is, to be honest. Uh, wait, it probably necklace. Let me see what's happening here. Okay, there are no closure. Um, so it's black beads, glass beads, and gold tone. And right here we have this kind of a pendant. And these are painted green and red. Okay. Okay. This is interesting. All right, we have another necklace. It's um, just a long necklace. Right here is distressed gunmetal color, kind of like a pendant, and painted it. And then we have minty color, minty color glass, glass beads. Okay, that's pretty long chain, and that's what we have. Here is another bracelet. Reminds me of the one we found at the beginning, but this one has not all black rhinestones. They're black and clear 
They're glass rhinestones, fold over clasp. The size of the bracelet is seven. Muted gold tone with black and clear rhinestones, size seven. Right here we have another very interesting necklace. So we have very pretty beads. This one's a like white, um, white cat's eye. This one's just faceted blue beads. We have barrel clasp, no expander. And right here we have this pendant. This is kind of a f fabric. This is hand painted and two dingles. Okay, that's that's what we have. The drop on this is nine no extender okay all right here we have another necklace we have seed beads and purple glass beads and silver tone a pendant oh that's enameled right here abstract very abstract it does have a silver tone lobster claw and a ex uh, pretty long extender and without an extender without an extender it's seven and a half without an extender it's seven and a half very pretty uh, glass beads very pretty green color and purple Okay. All right. Oh, this one's pretty. Natural stones. Okay, right here we have Express necklace. It does have some wear on, at the closure. And the chain is kind of like... Yeah, chains kind of seen better days, but uh, as a pendant, we have this very pretty solid silver tone bow with rhinestones. It, you can just, if you're crafty enough, you can just replace this chain because the bow is really cute and clean. And as far as it, it's concerned, I'm going to put the whole thing in the craft. Okay. Oh, this is very interesting necklace. We have silver tone lobster claw closure, um, somewhat probably inch and a half extender. And okay, it's very, very small, my friends. It's seven and a half inches drop without an extender, and extender is couple inches two and a half inches extender and we have very cool beads right here we have labradorite we have shell beads very pretty we have plastic beads yeah it's very cute this one's very cute labradorite is my favorite okay single earring glass glass dangle earring I'll put it aside Oh, this one's interesting necklace it's kind of small right here we have kind of um what do you call this um quartz that has inclusions in it rotolated 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 something like that there are black kind of angel hairs in it okay let's take a look at this closure because i have I have suspicions it might be silver guys even though I don't see the stamp but to me it looks like it might be silver yeah it, it scratches like one yep we have a silver necklace right here you, you probably can see right here we go you can see red scratch right here very red very nice so this is silver but it is very short you know what i'm saying uh it might not be 
it is 15 inches but you can also wear it as a bracelet see like this here we go it might be a wrap around bracelet with this stone or just 15 inches choker this is pretty cool this is actually jedi this is not cords it goes all the way to jedi you know this is really really cool look at this all right wrap around bracelet or necklace okay what's happening here so right here i have a gunmetal color chain with an new york so i don't have anything for it not that not this because yeah right here we have another choker very light faux pearls with a silver tone toggle the drop is drop is seven that's very small it's very small and lightweight then we have okay so right here we have a oh i see so gold tone chain with faux pearls and gold tone gold tone beads and then it comes to this drop as a pendant it's very very long look at this drop the drop them itself by itself is nine and a half inches and the necklace without an extender is drop is i think 11 or 10 and a half 11 so yeah you're gonna like wear it and then you have this very very long drop and what else we have more studs oh are these together i wonder if i have another clip on i don't see right now yeah i don't see right now but it seems like they are together let me do something yeah okay so Ah, they're not together this is separate because this one is cornelian and this one is glass so this right here we have a clip-on earring so we have a silver tone clip-on earring square with the glass cabochon oh oh this one is falling apart okay let me put this bracelet so I'm going to put this one aside. And right here we have a pendant. It might be silver with um, carnelian. Very pretty carnelian. Yeah, it's silver. I didn't scratch very well, but it is right there. We have like a little red right here. Yeah, it's silver. So we have a very cool silver pendant with carnelian. Another pendant without without a chain. All right, so what are you? Right here we have a bracelet it's a gold tone bracelet you open and close it like this right here we have some type of acrylic decoration and right here l and d l plus d silver tone taggy embrace the journey right here it says embrace the journey but i am not sure it belongs to this one so the bracelet is <coughs> size seven and this is acrylic just keep in mind this is acrylic okay right here we have a very pretty silver tone brooch 
Haven't had brooches in a while. Glass right here, glass rhinestone, and that's it. Oval silver tone brooch. Huh. Look at this. We have a gold tone a froggy. There is a little bit of a gold tone loss on a frog, but right here we have a gold tone chain. Chain is in a better condition than the frog, but there is a little bit of a lost gold on the there is a, a little bit of a gold loss on the toggle clasp. I don't see uh, the name right here on the froggy. I can see the name on the froggy. It says SI. It says SI. See? And right here we, on this side we have some kind of a triangle. And that's all we have, I think, and nothing else. It's magnetic. And nothing else. Um, there is no right. Uh, there is no extender, and the drop on this one is eight inches. Okay. Right here we have a memory wire bracelet. Again, we have silver tone, kind of a tubular links and rhinestones. Okay. Right here we have some kind of a plastic ring. Yeah. So it's craft. Right here we have, ooh, wait a minute. Let's see. CZs. Okay, silver tone and CZs bracelet. Very pretty. Very pretty. We have a fold over clasp. I don't see any names or any tags. Okay. It's very pretty, guys. A kind of a tennis bracelet. Very pretty. Look at these rhinestones. CZs. At size 7. I'll show you closer again. Or like very pretty. Very pretty. Size 7. Okay, right here we have a stretchy bracelet with a letter C and rhinestones. Gold tone stretchy bracelet. It stretches okay. So let us see right there with the rhinestones. That's gold tone beads. Right here we have another bracelet. It says Spark Lane on a tag. We have a, it's kind of pull, you know, and put it back in there. Chain. At some point it was very muted gold tone. Seven, size seven. I have a fish right here, fish charm and craft. Right here we have a, a coppery color bracelet, lobster claw, and we have a key. I don't know if it's a real key or not, but it says Grace on the, on it. Okay, size seven and a quarter. Seven and a quarter. All right, pulling more. Oh, wow, I recently found an earring like that. Oh, this is so cool. It's kind of like an Indian necklace. Let me see, I had, um, where did I put? It was in my single earrings. Yeah, I can't find it right now. I had only one earring, but now we found we found kind of a choker. Like earring was exactly like this. And we'll see if I find here another one. So right here we have a very interesting choker. I don't think this is silver. I tested the earring. It wasn't. Now it it has a hook and there is missing uh, you know what's missing the um, jump ring right here to hook it hook it to so I don't know what I'm probably gonna put it to craft guys okay okay another bracelet we have butterflies very pretty butterflies there we go very pretty butterfly silver tone uh, bracelet fold over clasp no names 
okay um they're pink blue i think they're kind of like abalone shells in the wings the size is seven inches silver tone with butterfly maybe, maybe abalone or shell um wings shell wings yeah i think it is shell wings okay um okay this bracelet i'm gonna go to craft uh, the condition is not really good bingo bracelet if you want to know the size it's eight and a half okay oh wow right here we have a interesting bracelet okay you can oh right here you can make it big or small regarding beads i don't see anything i don't see any names or stamps hmm. we have rhinestones right here so you will unscrew like this and you put charms on it okay this one screws also i don't see in anything but let me do so let me try huh interesting maybe i'm missing something because the bracelet is silver guys look at this bright red color it feels like silver i just don't yeah they look red i just can't find the um, stamp it should be stamped somewhere right huh interesting interesting so we have a kind of a bingo bracelet it's silver with beads and a very pretty glass charm yep glass charm the size is seven actually the size is yeah seven interesting it tested positive for silver right on but i can't find at least this one is silver i don't know about the beads but at least this is silver oh what is this what is beautiful thing is here i don't think we're gonna finish today guys i didn't know it's gonna there are so many cool things i thought we we're gonna finish We'll see how it goes. All right, so right here I have a muted gold tone necklace with a lobster claw closure and a pretty long extender. Okay, and then we have a chain with very pretty stations and we have rhinestones, kind of peachy color rhinestones right here, glass rhinestones. Sorry, guys, that's my magnet trying to attach itself to everything. Very, very pretty. Okay, let me take a look at what we have here. Oh, wow, look at this. <clears throat> so, look at this necklace. So, we have different like silk strands and seed beads, gold tone, and red seed beads, and it comes to this very pretty pendant right here we have acrylic bronzy color red rhinestones and here is the back it does have a somewhat extender a couple inches without it the drop is nine okay very pretty this one is like very shimmery and pretty right here we have a gold tone chain very uh, greenish yellow gold tone chain lobster claw long extender about three inches and right here we have a pendant it is acrylic a green acrylic pendant 
right here we have paparazzi earrings they're on the card new coppery kind of color kind of half moons uh, right here I have another charm it's probably like with the fish uh, this is the moon crescent moon and the fish and then I have oh wow silver tone chain with this open heart that has some rhinestones over here necklace let me see okay it has lobster claw closure very very long chain and the pendant is this open heart can we open it i wonder i wonder i don't think so yeah, I don't think so. It's just an open heart pendant. What else do I have interesting in here? Oh, this one's interesting. Some rings are interesting. Oh, is this oh I thought this one was uh, like what you call it uh, origami owl but it is not A silver tone chain in this shadow box shadow box pendant you can put stuff right there it's not um, origami owl yeah it's not shadow box necklace okay right here we have um a ring i'm gonna put this on to craft not only that it's missing rhinestone it's missing all its silver tone and you can see copper so i'm gonna put this one to craft right here i have another size 20 let me give you 10 size 10 it's kind of a gold tone with uh, stainless steel with um, some um, stars right here ring what else um, I don't know what this is probably used to be an earring but it's broken I'm gonna put this thing to craft uh, plastic ring beige plastic ring size six and a half let me see let me see if I don't think it's um, I doubt that this is a Bakelite but just in case just in case take a little bit of this paste the semi-chrome polish no no yeah I didn't think so Alexa stop Alexa stop oh my goodness my Alexa all right the size did I tell you the size size six and a half on this plastic beige plastic ring right here we have a stretch a bracelet a stretch is kind of on the tougher side uh, we have ceramic beads and we have I think this is glass yeah these ones are glass art glass kind of beads some are plain some are with this kind of decoration stretches like i said on the tougher side okay all right let's see shall we finish what do you think do you think we can do it maybe we can we have a little bit of left Right here I dropped a stud earring, put it aside. Uh, this earring, I know I had one, I put it in, uh, in craft, I think, a long time ago. So aside, this one earring is missing something in the 
in the cage. I'm going to put it aside and I still only have one. Right here we have stretchy silver tone bracelet, seven and a half with purple rhinestones. Size, like I said, seven and a half. Stretch is good. Silver tone with AB coated rhinestones bangle bracelet. Very clean in a great condition. No scratches. Very nice. Size eight. Very pretty bangle. Oh, I think we found silver. Yep, we found silver bracelet, 925, 925 Italy. And right here we have S. Right here we have again, 925 Italy. Nice chunky chain bracelet. Size six and three quarters. No extender, nice, nice, nice. Okay. Right here we have a stretchy bracelet, glass beads with, I don't know, some religious kind of a pendant or charm. Right here we probably have a saint and we have glass beads, nice stretch. Uh, bib style necklace, gold tone chain with a closure, love circle and extender and right here we have acrylic, um, kind of a yellowish peachy color bib style rhinestone big rhinestones and here's the back and we don't have any names okay uh, right here I have a bracelet I put necklace choker like this in the craft there are faux pearls it's memory wire Okay, stretchy bracelet. Stretch is okay. We have a tag right here. It says, oh, this one is J. Crew. J. Crew bracelet, uh, brushed gold tone with yellow rhinestones. Rhinestones are glass. Okay, the stretch is really good. J. Crew bracelet, size seven. Right here we have another size 21 stainless steel ring, probably men's. We have gold tone with some engraving right here. Size almost 12, I would say 11 and three quarters. Right here we have a cord necklace with the gold tone and I think it's, um, resin yeah pendant bracelet silver tone toggle clasp let me see what it says on the tag let me see what it says on the tag on the tag it says oh we need to make it closer to see what it says and it's so tiny it says Monet. Okay. I think it says Monet. Well, anyway, we have a silver tone bracelet with purple and pink cat's eye beads. The size is six and three quarters. Okay. Um, another, this might be silver earring, but maybe not. No, it's not, but it's still single one stud. Right here I have another single earring, a faux pearl and silver tone and rhinestones. Dangle earring, still only one. Right here we have a stretchy bracelet. These are very pretty crystals, guys. Very pretty crystals. S stretch is not good. It's very tough. It's like old stretch. But if you want to restretch it, I think this one are worth it. They're a little bit smoky color. The bracelet as is right now, it's seven inches. Uh, right here I have a cross. Uh, actually, it's crucifix. Silver tone crucifix. Uh, right here is, oh, right here we have a bracelet, a gold tone. There's a little bit of a gold tone loss, especially on a fold over clasp. No name, uh, faux pearls. This way it's in a better condition like this than inside. The size is seven nice bracelet 
right here we have a necklace gold tone closure no extender we have and then we have natural chips and a graduated i think shell kind of sequence okay let's see the drop is eight the drop is eight and it's very pretty we have aventurine we have maybe quartz tiger's eye chips you know very pretty like maybe this one is um agate or some sort very pretty necklace right here we have another bracelet this one outstretch overstretch with rhinestones and this one goes to craft another bracelet a gold tone we have a closure uh, it's kind of a brushed a gold tone bracelet let me see no extenders let me give you the size of the bracelet eight oh it's actually an anklet guys it's nine inches right here we have an anklet there might be a little bit kind of a distress on some of the flowers tips but other than that you know anklet okay oh look at this pretty necklace uh, necklace oh wow we're gonna be a little bit over than an hour it's okay but we'll finish it at least so we have a fold over clasp we don't have any names or any tags uh, it's very pretty look at this look how gorgeous this is all the rhinestones seems to be here i don't really see that the rhinestones also it's very pretty very pretty necklace the drop on this one let's see the drop is oh, it's hard it's hard guys it's hard to measure it let me give you the whole the whole length 15 inches yeah this one is very small 15 inches very pretty necklace all right let's see right here we have glass necklace so we have a lobster claw we have flutterly a flutterly flutterly <laughs> i can't say it i don't understand it's a tongue twister for me today and we have um silver tone infinity sign with the rhinestones i'm not sure it's supposed to be on the I, it looks like someone just added it you can remove it this bicone faceted beads are glass they're very pretty dark blue color see this very pretty color they kind of spiky to wear them they're very sharp like glass is the size on this one i would remove this and this i would definitely remove it the drop on this one is ten and a half inches okay this sharp i don't know another kind of thing i don't know what this is for uh right here we have interesting okay right here we have another necklace it's uh three strands i do believe yeah three strands they are lightly layered silver toned beads there is a long extender by the by itself this necklace is quite short i would say it's seven and a half maybe yeah seven and a half inches drop and a three inches extender okay silver tone it's it's really dark outside right now so i hope i have enough lightning um lighting for you lightning <laughs> i hope i have enough lighting for you guys so you can see all right three strands choker color necklace very pretty silver tone okay i want to take a look what this is oh wow this one's might be silver this one uh oh we need to be very very gentle with this right here i have another this one is a silver 
earring but I think I see only one it's a turtle turtle with a flower and there is like a 9 to 5 right here I can turn it into I can turn it into um, the pendant if I don't find it come on I can turn it into pendant but for now I'm gonna put it aside right here we have a very interesting necklace hold on let me figure out what's happening here What's happened? Okay. Okay. So this is very interesting necklace. It's a very dainty chain. Then we have um, a druzy right here, very pretty druzy. And then we have very chunky extender, and it says Crystal Wolf on this tag. Says Crystal Wolf, and right here we have a, like a a face of a wolf. So, comparing the extender with the, kind of a on that very heavy tag, and right here we have a very dainty chain with very dainty a druzy. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of over. This is the heavier than the whole chain, to be honest with you. Okay. Okay, let's take a look at this one. This is very interesting. I do believe this is silver. And it's very denty. And it's like, oh. Oh, no. Ay, ay, ay. This chain is so denty. I'm scared to rip it. And the pendant on it is heavy. Such a... You know what I think? I think the necklace got in completely inside. Here we go. Here we go. I opened it a little bit. Now I have to close it. We need to close this one okay all right okay so we have we have a very dainty chain let's double check it's is it silver or is it white gold let's take a look nine to five i see nine to five so we have a very dainty very lightweight silver chain and we have a pendant P a pendant is also silver with probably a very nice can you imagine diamond this size we have a cz yes we have cubic zirconia on this pendant it's very pretty sorry for my dirty fingers though and it's right here also says nine to five so very dainty chain with this very pretty silver pendant with cz's okay right here we have oh wait a minute is this second earring i just lost in my drawer i think so is it the same or let me see Oh, I think it's the same one. Yeah, it's the same one. Okay, so right here, right, right here, we have a very cool ne pearl necklace. The pearl is real. It's a freshwater pearl choker necklace. So, in right here, we have on the closure it says gold field, fourteen carat, probably gold field. Yeah, right there. See, it says on the tongue. 1420 GF gold field. So we have a very chunky gold field closure and freshwater pearls. It is seven and a half inches drop. Beautiful necklace, beautiful. Over here we have a plastic necklace. We have um, 
barrel clasp closure and green beads um, I am gonna put this to craft there's a lot of wear to the beads you know so this one goes to craft right here we have a stretchy bracelet we have shells we have um, this one's our shells right here we have star charm and it says Alex and Ani Alex and Ani I had no idea they're doing this yeah I had no idea they have stretchy bracelets Alex and Ani okay and right here Alex and Ani so stretch is really good uh, very clean very nice and great condition stretchy Alex and Ani bracelet okay right here we have another shell uh, not shell but yeah shell and pearls they are real these pearls are definitely real and right here we have beads that i think are they are quartz yeah these are uh quartz right here this one the quartz this one quartz this one quartz very pretty necklace real eight and a half inches drop yep eight and a half inches pearls are different color very pretty nice pearls um this one is probably for the necklace that we found earlier today and the very very beginning remember the necklace it's kind of the same faux pearls metallic color and gold tone closure nice bracelet the size is six and three quarters Okay. Uh, we just found a bracelet like this and right here we have a necklace to the bracelet so if you want it let me know as I said the drop is seven and a half and there is a pretty long extender and we have a we have a tag that says uh, Monet right I think yeah it's Monet we have a cat's eye beads so yeah it was a bracelet to this necklace here's another hematite necklace so we have barrel clasp closure and then just a hematite necklace no pendants uh, the drop on this one is nine yep drop on this one is nine nice hematite necklace we have another interesting necklace kind of a religious theme right here gunmetal color with different dangles hearts crosses yeah this one's i don't know what this is floor release at least i can say it now so like this okay Let me give you the drop without an extender, an extender about three inches. Drop without an extender is eight. Gunmetal color. Right here we have another gold tone necklace with acrylic, more on the orange side. This one's a square um, design, beef style again no tags a uh, very clean lobster claw yeah very pretty this ones are orange more on the orange side the other one that we found earlier was more on the yellow side okay this one's square the other ones were teardrop here's the back they're acrylic right here we have a stretchy bracelet very pretty stre stretch is really good very pretty lavender purple kind of rhinestones size is six without any stretch and the rhinestones are glass very pretty okay so right here we have an earring i found it um, like this um, the other day these are not silver but if you want this here is a pair for the other one we found the other day now right here we have a um, chain gold tone long chain with the one pendant i don't know what this is is it like 
nothing it's it's a some kind of a pendant holder yeah i don't know what this is i'm just gonna you, you can open it see you can put pendant on it and close it i'm just gonna put this on to craft uh right here we have it's probably banana Re yeah banana republic necklace okay banana republic necklace one single strand with uh faceted beads and kind of discs right here the link for this is drop is 18 pretty banana republic uh, right here i have a um, pendant or maybe it used to be an earring but i'm just gonna put it to craft right here we have a screw back very pretty on this side we have pearls faux pearls on this side we have ab coated rhinestones see very pretty but it's only one screw back um oh no look at this what a what's happening ay 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 this is definitely probably gold or silver and the chains are so dainty i i don't know it's like a whisper this might be gold i'm gonna bring my detangler handy dandy because this one see one of these necklaces probably the one that is gold uh, color has this kind of a cherry like cherry like pendant so it's all kind of wrapped up around this and we have to be very gentle very gentle let's see Okay. Is that attached to anything or no? Wait a minute, I don't even think it's attached to anything. Oh no, it is, it is, it is. Okay. So the silver tone, I would I, I assume chain, is for this pendant. Okay, we're gonna be very, very gentle. What a find at the end, so cool. My dear friends, I just wanna also thank, thank you for keeping your fingers crossed for me during my interviews so hopefully i'm gonna hear soon because i was having a lot of interviews recently just two today so hopefully hopefully something will come my way and i will definitely update you and we will celebrate together and let me know if you think i should do the um, the membership because the reason why i want to do memberships is because i'm going to, probably going to be overwhelmed if it's going to be everybody but membership is kind of paid like 5.99 i think the smallest for a month and not a lot of people will do that and maybe what i'm saying is it's just i'm just we will hang out not going to be too many people so it won't get too overwhelming because I'm going to be detangling, I'm going to be like unbagging and talking to you guys at the same time. And if there are a lot of people, I might miss the questions or something like that. So let me know your thoughts. I would be very interested if what you guys think. Okay. We're almost there. We're almost there. The last knot. I think the last yeah the last one and i'll put chain i put this pendant on the chain 
I'm not quite sure, to be honest with you, because it has like these beads right here. I'm not quite sure if it belongs to this one. And I don't have... I don't have any uh, anything else to put on this silver chain. Okay, so let's take a look. Let's take a look. See, we have labradorite um, beads, so I'm not quite sure. It does say 925, yes, right here. I can see 925. So for now, I'm going to put it right here if it fits. Nope, it doesn't fit. Yeah, because of the bead, it doesn't fit, and we have a bead on both sides. So I'm definitely going to give you the chain if you want for this one. You can get it by itself right here we have a very dainty silver chain with two labradorite beads on both sides very very pretty very flashy it's very dainty silver chain um this right here we have it might be gold we're gonna take a look in a minute okay also, so okay. What's happening? I want to, okay, I had to pause you guys for, a, guys for a second, I couldn't make you, okay, so if I thought that silver tone was dainty, this one is way daintier, so we have a chain, and we have this kind of like a cherries or whatever it is, like a flowers pendant, let me tell you what this the rhinestones are glass the rhinestones are glass now let's take a look at the chain oh so dainty you probably can't even see right here says oh my goodness i don't even know what it says cramens Oh my goodness, it's Kremens. I don't think it's anything, it's just Kremens. So this one is probably not precious. Yeah, it's not precious. It's um it's magnetic slightly, but it it says Kremens. So right here we have very dainty Kremens necklace with this pendant. It's very dainty. I'm going to immediately, after showing to you guys, put it in a separate bag so it won't, um, won't, will not tangle anymore. It's so pretty. So pretty. Okay. It was worth it, untangling it. All right, so now we have right here stretchy bracelets. There are three of them in this pack. Uh, stretches, oh, I think, how is it supposed to be? I'm so confused. Oh, here we go. Stretch is good. Uh, we have it like um, some charms right here. Stretch is actually on the older side. These ones are some acrylic, some glass. This one's glass, this one's glass. They're, they're glass. Stretch is okay, guys. It's on, kind of on the older side. Size 7. Stretch bracelet. Um, copper bracelet. It, it says copper right here. Okay, a copper bracelet. A very cool kind of closure. I don't know what's the name of this closure. I, I can't remember from the top of my head. So it says copper, very big, chunky links. It does have some weight to it, seven and a quarter. Right here, seven and a quarter. Another single, um, did I show you guys? Yeah, this one, seven and a quarter. Another single 
um, earring, earring stud, and a couple of bracelets. Right here we have a gold tone bracelet, lobster claw, big extender with rhinestones, size seven and three quarters um, as is, and it's on the very shorter side. It might be um, an anklet, to be honest. And the last one is we have bronzy collar bracelet, lobster, no name, with a feather. Right here with a feather, no extender, size six and three quarters. All right, my friends, we did it. I apologize for this video being long. It's um hour and 20 minutes, but we did it. We finished with this bag. It was an awesome bag. Um, let me know what you think. Don't forget to subscribe. Let, let me know my ideas about membership, what you think about it. And um, I will update you on my interview results. And thank you so much for being here with me. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you very, very soon. Bye-bye.